Yo, what's up, Tarnish? It's Bobby, and we're back with another video. So, in today's video, we're gonna be talking about um, Grimoire. Uh, I can't even speak. Grimoire storage, right? And how it works. You know, for everybody that's worried about it, and like, if it's worth it. You know, if it's worth it, should you buy it? Honestly, I think it's worth it. It's crazy, and I'm gonna go straight into depth about like how it actually works. We're gonna go pull up the pricing and everything, bro. And for those who are commenting that was happening in my video, um, last video, obviously I was trying to put on a character, so the video is not too boring, but you know, I guess I just want dry, dry content, dry content, no type of character at all. So that's, that's a little crazy to me personally. I wouldn't, I mean, a lot of y'all showed support. So, you know, obviously there's always going to be those haters, those trolls in, in the comments for sure. But if y'all want, um, the grimoire storage, it used to be. I think 100 Robux less. They increased their one Robux, 100 Robux, which is not that bad. I honestly thought it would have jumped up to 2,000 Robux. You feel me? But just how much it is right now, go ahead and cop that for sure. And no, this is not a. I'm not promoting like for you to buy the game. I ain't get. I don't get paid to do this at all. I'm just doing it because you know, just to show love. Like, bro, showing love is free, bro. Like, it's, it really doesn't cost anything. I don't. I don't so I, that's why sometimes I don't even understand why I don't sub. Let's get straight into the game, though. Let's get straight in there. I'm going to push this back aside now that y'all seen the price for it. Is it worth it, personally? And I, as y'all can see, I own it. Um, I think it's worth it. I have all the game passes to support the game. I think the game is a very good game. All the game passes are actually really, like, they have a purpose. The private server, the Clover storage, the VIP, you get more spins. Like, it's everything is just, it ties into each other, you know? So, with the with the, with the the bag, right? Yes, I have time for Leaf in game. You know, these spins exist for a reason. You know what I'm saying? These spins exist for a reason. So, because I know a lot. Oh my God! Oh my God! Listen, relax. And I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna show you what um what magic um what build I'm running with this magic also currently. But I'm still testing though. So there might be a better one out there. I'm still testing. It's not like you feel me set in stone. And then I got a and I got a PVP video coming later. Um, with every time um every magic against all the other magics all right so right now i'm just leveling up the clover for this but when you spin right say if i have time magic and i just click spin you have to spin off of the magic for the magic to save you can you can hold one of each magic now you're wondering like oh what if what if it's a four leaf all right say if you continue spinning and you fall on um, um time again it's gonna automatically be down four leaf once you unlock with the grimoire once you unlock four leaf for a pacific magic say it's water that whenever you land on water, it will forever be four leaf. Say if you unlock four leaf for all of them, they all will forever be four leaf. It just upgrades. What I was complaining about was just solved right there. You just need to spend a little bit of Robux. So I honestly don't think that they need. If you if you get that, it's possible. For me, I'm running monstrous reserves. Monstrous reserves just had a a massive buff, and I'm running dread scale, and then you know with time magic, and this is what it looks like. Once you have it, if I click on World Tree, it just says Equip World Tree, and then Four Leaf World Tree. And if I look for time, as you can see, I have one of every magic. I did end up getting Void when I was, I had like a crazy amount of spins, so I'm not gonna lie, I had like 700 plus spins. And yes, I used all my 700, obviously, it's at zero. I don't have that much spins anymore. You know, I have a few in, in those over there. But I got, I ended up getting Void, Um, I ended up getting Blood, you know, I'll, I'll do a little, like, they're regular, though. I'm going to try to get four leaf for them, obviously. So I can, you know, use, especially blood, because the next update has to do with blood. So if I want to pump that out, I'm going to try to, like, get some some stuff situated with that for sure. But then let me hop in the server for y'all real quick, and then I'll show y'all what build I'm running. So from here on out, this, the showcase for the Grimoire is already out the window. I said Grimoire is out the window. Uh, the the clover um storage how it works and is it worth it yes it's worth it you get every single magic it saves clovers it saves all like literally saves everything like like you remember how all right you remember how i had time well i didn't see it but i spun off a of time magic right all right cool let's add our abilities back i would say put future sight towards like the back because it's you know it's uh it's not something you're gonna use a lot you want to do me i do mana burst and then i go straight into fear and then I use flick, then stasis. Huh? Hold on, give me a minute. 
That's not right. Oh, let me just reset my character real quick. Might just be a bug. Wow, what the hell? I, all right, I have bronze clovers here, but I'm gonna let them know that you know that's a bug. So, if you if you got if you end up getting um any any clovers on your abilities, guys, just be careful with spinning it off until I let them know. But yeah, um, and if you want to, for everybody asking me, what does um time? How do you know if you have time magic four leaf? One, once you spin it, you see time magic four leaf, and then two, how you know is somebody has an aura like this, like your it glows. It has like an angelic glow on your book. You can't see your mastery, you know, that, I mean, damn. I mean, I don't know where you want them to put the mastery, like on each page, just flipping around. That would look bad. Horrible. Horrible. All right, so I think they should just, you can just go in your stats and then look at magic mastery. Magic mastery saves across the board. Across the board. So you don't have to continuously do your mastery. But you do got to farm your clover, though. For those who wanted to know, yes, it saves across, like, say if you have mastery for that, it saves for all magic. All magics get, like, the same mastery saves for every book. So, you feel me? There you go. Then you can just level up your clovers. Um. Oh, yeah, the build that I'm running. The build that I'm running. I almost forgot. I just, this is, this is what I was trying out. I was doing 85 intelligence, 100 um, con, and 43 decks. This is from armor, straight up armor. That's why I was gonna run with my Dread Scale, Time Magic, and Monstrous Reserves. You know, so I can take this information with a grain of salt, but I'm gonna be cutting the video here. Leave a like, comment, subscribe. Catch y'all on the next one. Peace.